Crawford with Remax Elite Realtors coming to you from my home office in Pleasant Hill, Missouri with your Pleasant Hill, Missouri market update. So we are just over halfway through June of 2021, which also puts us a little over halfway through um, 2021 itself. And I just want to come to you and let you know what's going on in our market. Gonna warn you, it's a lot of the same. Trends continue. Um, so we have 11 active listings in all of Pleasant Hill. Yes, inventory is still low, if you're wondering. And those homes range from 87,000 up to 749,000. We have 38 under contract currently, and we have three in the pre-MLS, which means they are homes that will hit the market. They just haven't yet. Um, they are coming. So if you are in this price range, these are a few that you may want to look into, and I'm happy to get information on them for you if you are. They range from 339,000 up to 498,000. We sold 33 homes in the last month, last 30 days. This time last year, we had sold 23. So we've actually sold more homes than we had, did this time last year. Now for the year, we're sitting um, really, really close to what we were last year. We sold 98 this year, 101 last year. So um, pretty much the same. And you might be asking, why is inventory even more low than we were last year than if we're selling more homes? Well, you might guess we have more buyers. People, we are, we're listing homes. We have homes to sell. It's just that we have so many buyers. They're just eating them up so quickly. We just can't keep them on the market. So now's a great time to sell. Can be a little bit frustrating time to buy, unfortunately. But if you have an agent who's working hard for you, um, has some unique strategies to help you get homes, has good communication skills, um, that's going to help you. Um, I'm happy to help in those areas as well. So um, average days on market, how fast are homes selling? I'm going to warn you, this number is a little bit skewed for a number of reasons, which I can explain in um, a conversation if you are interested in that. There are, um, they have been selling on average for the year um, in 19 days. In June, seven days. Um, like I said, there's some, some things that skew those numbers, but in most cases they are selling within three days of listing or so. Um, obviously some are selling the day they list too. So if they're, if they're priced right, they're going super quick. That's what you need to know. Um, the average list to close price per ratio is, so take the list price what it sold for, what percentage of that original price did it sell for. We are sitting at 102.5% for June. That is up 4.1% from last year and 1.5% from May of this year. So what's that mean? They're selling for more than what they're listing for. We have so many buyers, they're driving up the price. Um, and if you're out in the market and you're buying, you know that probably on most homes you're going to be offering more than list price. The average sale price um, for uh, May and then this portion of June that we have is just about $302,000. And in 2020, that was 275,000. So we're up about $27,000 um, in average on this, the sale price of homes in Pleasant Hill. If you have any questions regarding buying, selling, both some um, unique strategies that I might have, if you're worried about listing and buying, if you sell your house too quick and you can't find something, what am I going to do? Um, there are some things that we can do um, to kind of alleviate some of that stress. So feel free to reach out to me. My number is 816-255-5268. Call or text me. That's probably the best way to get a hold of me. But you can email me also at www.myagentmindy.com. And you can check out my website to do some searching if you're interested in that at www.myagentmindy.com. And I know it's hot out there. Drink your water, use your sunscreen if you're getting burnt, and stay cool. Talk to you soon.